my dudes, it's only been like hours since I、uh, played this. Since hours, like you know, the fourth part for you guys it probably be days. For me, it was only hours. Like what?、Well, pretty much after the family movie night that we had, um, I got back to this game. I wanted to try out first of all. I want to try out more of the VR sessions. You know, with the actual VR. My goodness, noir. Kind of getting up closer, and it's actually kind of hot. But second, I really wanted to come back to this game because I really want to know what's going on. In the actual story mode, and if the audio can please come back to me, that'll be great. Okay, so let's actually just get into it. I really want to see what happens, and I'm still praying. All right, I think we're in the clear. Okay, Gearsy. Seriously, what the hell was that? Well, you were in danger, Uzume. My body just kind of moved on its own, and before I knew it, I was jumping out of the turn. None of that matters. I shouldn't even have been part of that equation. This was your chance. What are you doing, wasting it on me? So stupid. It, it wasn't stupid, and it wasn't a waste. You're still here, and you're safe, and that's what matters to me. Okay. If I have to sacrifice someone to get home, then it's not worth it to me. I'm sure Big Sis would say the exact same thing. But then, but then, how can I ever forgive myself for ruining your only way home? Uzume, it's in the past. What's important now is to begin planning our next move. That's easy. We're going right back over there and wrecking each and every last one of them. Maybe Gearsy can still make it back home. Even if we return there, if the terminal was heavily beaten in the battle, I doubt it's usable any longer. Oof. Then what are we supposed to do? Our current foe differs from the giant in that she has clear objectives when mounting her attack. I propose we evacuate this area completely. You really want us to run away from her? Not exactly. We'll need to devise an appropriate strategy of retaliation. Considering this foe is so different from what we faced in the past, concurrently we can also be considering alternative options to return Gearsy home. Okay, as long as we get to fight back. I hate being passive. It doesn't feel right. Oof. Well, I mean, from your personality, I can definitely tell why. Understood. Let us return to our main base. Some of our friends may be able to offer help. I'm sorry to interrupt, but what do you mean by main base, Uzume? Wasn't this your base? I guess I never mentioned it. This was just a temporary base we created for our bouts with the giant. And don't think asking me questions is gonna make me forget your foolish move. You're in for a long lecture once we get over there, Gearsy. <laughs> Please go easy on me. <laughs> this is why I love her so much. <laughs> Here. So is this the main base? I don't know. I cave. Let's、What? do our best. Hi. Oh, here we go. No voice acting. Okay, that's fine. I mean, maybe I don't know. Okay, so this is actually a shortcut. Yeah.、Oh, of course, she's back. Our fair. I don't even know how to pronounce that name, but this is supposedly a shortcut so that they wouldn't be spotted. So, but it seems like that our the witch lady apparently has seems maybe she she found them. So she's after them, even though this is supposed to be a secret. Wee wee wee. All right. You're my opponent. What should I do? All right. Well, hopefully, well, you know,、uh, this stuff makes it really strong, which I guess it does. I'll end this all. Don't mess with me. All right, defeated. Next. I right, let's go. Let's go. I finished this stylishly. So I don't. I still don't know how I'm gonna be able to edit this. I feel like I'm just gonna like skip parts of this. Yeah. And you know, kind of just you know. What should I do? Oh yeah. One thing I should probably do is uh, 
actually upgrade their, you know, moveset, stuff like that. Character level is above, right? Oh, acquire credits, all right. So how much credit do I have then? Oh, wait, are those credits down there? Little Mike Money signs or is that something else? I earned 217 credits. Wait, credits detail actually. Uh. Okay. I think I'm a little closer to Neptune now. Oh, she also leveled up. That's cool. She's now level 22. Dang, her end gear is just as is almost as important as her life. That's crazy. I think that hitting it is just making the damage even worse. <laughs> what? Really? Wow, she just realizes this. <laughs> she has this innocent race. I think so. All right, well, they're building a better relationship. Talking about radios, or talking about Uzume's radio that they could fix up. Yeah, let's all go now, everyone. Looks like we win this match. Yeah, level up. And she leveled up too, so we get to see that nice, that, you know. Okay, I have enough credits. I'm gonna try and level her up. There we go. Now she knows rapid hit. Oh no, wait. Oh, I should have tried this power slash. Okay. Well, at least she learned something for the other one at least, right? Not bad. Major damage. Major. Oh my gosh, really? That's an attack? Why did they get Not so bad. many turns? Really, game. I really. I hurry and be cool like Neptune. Aren't we there yet, Umi? Oh no, we just skipped that whole thing apparently. This is most strange. It should have been straight along this path. Don't be alarmed, but it appears that we've lost our way. Let us retrace our steps. <laughs> oh great, she's back. The witch lady. Playtime is over, brats. Oh, you're that pop-up purple hag! I am not a pop-up purple hag! <laughs> My name is R4. R4? A name that will signal your demise and ring the bell of destruction for this hopeless world. R4 is the name? That is Something about that just doesn't sound right, especially with the spelling of the name. This location does not exist on any map in existence. How do you know of this place? Simple. I took the liberty of following you fools who didn't have the sense to cover your tracks. Ouch. Because of your stupidity, I was able to trap you all here in this dead end, so thank you. Wow, okay, buddy. Whoa, like, gross! Being a stalker is, like, so totally creepy! Ew! Who's <laughs> made your speech? Blast. My deepest apologies to you both. I should have known better. This is my fault. Ouch. Oh, you don't gotta be sorry, Umio. We'll just have to crush her. No sweat. If we can, which can yeah, we? Uzume's right. We might be cornered, but we don't have a super huge horde of monsters to fight here. We could. A cornered oh. animal has nothing to Skipped lose. Skipped it on accident. We'll get in her she face said we could do it. Stupid grin to shreds. You won't even recognize her when we're done. You too. R4, prepare yourself. Your life will end here. Will we finish her off? What? What did you say just now? Huh? Um, I said, R4, prepare yourself. Your life will end here. Just the first part. Just say the first part one more time. The first, you mean just say your name? R4? One more time with some respect. <laughs> oh my gosh. Miss R4? Oh. 
Oh my god. Since first I appeared, it's been R snore this, R bore that, or pop up purple hag, the worst. Finally, finally, you called me by my name. Ah, <laughs> I guess she was actually pretty bothered by our name calling. Hey, R4, since I called you by name, you'll let us pass by you now, right? Of course. You are one of the few... No, the only one who's ever used my name. That is an effortless request to fulfill. What? That was a potential boss fight? And the only reason why she was harassing the heck out of us was because everyone but Nepgear got her name wrong. Nepgear, you see how much of an angel you are? Because you've got her name right, you have avoided a potential boss battle. I don't know how this would have ended, but oh my gosh. See, you know, Nepgear. Yay! Thank you so much! Nepgear, oh my gosh. Idiot. You really expected me to do that? Okay, never mind. Aw, oh, darn. I knew it. Show's I spoke too over. soon. We'll just make our way by force. Looks like you're alone, too. We're gonna make you regret not bringing reinforcements. Well, I mean, at least Gearsy, it was a good attempt, let's get right? Serious. You got it. I guess I react a little too early. I mean, then again, she is the same woman who has like the most cliche lines, so I just I don't know. Anything can happen at this point. Prepare to die. So are we actually fighting her? Yes. I guess we have to do this. Four bars of health? Hello? Oh my god. Oh. Never mind, we got this. Ruin to all. Consume oh. all. Wow. Whoa. That did a lot of damage. Okay, but at least she takes a lot no of damage. Especially from Nepgear. Do the job. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Look at that health getting shredded. Not be my end. Die. Oh, that's this is bad. Okay, uh, maybe take a healing potion just in case, because I'm not willing to risk the idea of dying in the middle of the fight. Don't joke with me. All right, she All right. should be I'll dead, right? Let's go! Quick boss I fight, let's go! This. I'm gonna just move that Even a way. CPU candidate can get things done when it counts. Let's go. Yay, my level went Whoa! Up. Okay, ma'am. Hold up there. Nice booty, but we I didn't need to see that. <sighs> not bad. You're way too strong for a lowly pop-up hag, but it's not enough! We nabbed this victory! What delusions are you living in? I've barely used half of my strength. Well, crud. <laughs> Kozume won't fall for that. Your ignorance will cost you. It's time for you to learn your place the hard way. My true form and my true power. Does she go big? Or is she like goddess? Oh my, what the? That form. Why are you in that form? You have a microphone. What? Did you really just say that? I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Oh, you're so cute when you're in a panic, Gearsy. Goodness. Joking around at a time like this is bad for my poor heart. Aww. Oh. You girls think this is a time for jokes? Very well then, suit yourself. Die! I realize her name is the Netgear's uh, HDD name is Purple Sister. I can't muster any strength. That just took them down, apparently. What's that? No witty joke. No punchline at my expense. Go ahead. Call me a pop up hag again. <laughs> I dare you. This is it, Gearsy. I'm sorry. Ah! Wait, that voice. Is that... What is it, Gearsy? I thought I just heard Neptune's voice. Ne 
Pepsi's voice? Huh. Don't think I'll fall for such an obvious time-wasting bluff. I will end you! Move, move, move! I'm gonna crash! Huh? huh? Smoke. <coughs> See who I think it is? What? What I swear. Were those it, losers really able to fall for reinforcements? Is. is it who I think it is? Oh my oh, god! Man, I really took a tumble there. Shoot, I was so close to falling. <gasps> it's the top Oh my god! Look at her! <laughs> she got some nice chest though, but oh my gosh! <laughs> I had him, I'm actually so happy we get to finally play as her in the game! Oh my gosh! I didn't realize the ground was missing there. I had a feeling she had to come at some point because I was thinking like, okay, well, if Neptune can't come home, what about her? Isn't she a dimension hopper or something? It's a good thing She's the here. Resilient Let's enough to keep working, even after taking a fall from such tall heights. Yeah, I can tell from you landing on my what? bed. It's the people who were down below. Hey, you guys hurt? Everyone okay? <laughs> She's so cute. Well, who oh, are yeah. you? It's adult Neptune. Oh my gosh. Me? Oh. My name's Neptune. Oh my gosh. Look at her. <gasps> <laughs> to be honest, I'm a bug hunter who explores other dimensions. I just happen to be passing by. Yeah, see? A dimension hopper. Uh... <laughs> Oops! Oh Looks like gosh. you all were in the middle of something. Sorry for interrupting you. Uh... <laughs> hmm... I Maybe I'm a little overexcited. Here. Considering I'm an ally to all cute girls, I'm gonna be helping you with your situation here. Uh, um... Hey, cutie, with the pink hair. What's your name? Oh my gosh. Yep, you. My name is Nep here. Wow, you have Nep in your name too. Crazy. This Nep can't help but feel like there's some kind of sentimental fate at play here. Oh my gosh, hey. okay. Hey, hey Umio, what's going on? Nepsy left, grew up super fast, and then fell on us. Even I cannot begin to understand this. That's a different but Neptune. If she's willing to help us, her presence will be quite appreciated. That's adult Neptune. Hey. <laughs> hey. Oh? Excuse me. Are you me. guys Nepgear's friends? That thing on your wrist is really cool. <laughs> Let me see it. Oh my gosh. Cool? <laughs> if you can understand the level of cool my radio wields, then even in your adult state, you're pretty smart, Nepsy. Hey! <laughs> She's trying to... Hey! Hello! Now is not the time for... Wait, what's this fish? <laughs> That's hilarious! Look at his serious mug! I said hey! Yikes, the weirdo lady just lost it. <laughs> your pointless babbling. How dare you cretins ignore me! I, I really think oh, Adult Neptune's sorry. my favorite Did character you now. Never you mind. In our conversation? Because no. I think I'll pass on including a terrible person who torments cute girls. Plus, uh, no offense, but you look kinda creepy. I think she already figured that out. Running your mouth like that. I, R4, will have you pay for making a mockery of me. You will pay with your life. Arbor? What? <laughs> <laughs> what a weird name! It's not R4, it's R4! 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 <laughs> R <-fjord? laughs> oh Why do they call you that? I seriously doubt anyone sailed up that inlet in over a millennia. <laughs> I'd blame your wardrobe. comes close to her and riling up Grandma Arfie over there. Wow. I think the bigger problem is that Arfor is just unable to cope with being instigated. I will never forgive you. 
I'll murder all four of you at once! Oh, hold up. Quick timeout. Huh? Are you kidding it's me? It's RPG tradition to heal up before battle. Today, as a special present, I'll give you girls the Netball V2 that I just made. Oh, well, she's a fourth wall breaker it's a totally as well. crazy color! But is it alright? They say bitter medicine's the best, so a little bitterness is kind of fun. Go ahead, slam it down like milk after a nice hot bath. All in one go. Do it! Okay. This is best girl right really here. Really bitter, but wow, my wounds are healing. I think my strength's coming back too. We can probably win against her now. Now let's get pumped up for the boss battle. <gasps> oh my gosh, we get to play as a top man too. Let's get it. Level twenty. What? Level twenty-seven? Are you? Mm, okay, buddy. So she's a. Uh, Superiorly higher level than um, apparently everyone. So apparently that means that uh, nameless katana. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, I can. Oh, I can actually. Wait, wait, hold up, 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 hold up. Let's learn this. Right. Okay. How much? Oh. Okay. That should be all we know now. I'll fly us into a future I guess without this dummy. Okay, power edge and oh, okay, oh, I see. Here I come. Not bad. All right. Ruin to all. Yeah. Stop. Okay. Wow. So you're already gonna put her at poison? Like really? Really, might? Ooh. Oh. Okay, so you should have a third set of attacks. You don't escape. I like how she sounds so Ta -da! deep. Uzume's turn. Yay, Uzume's turn. Can we actually use a special? Yes, we can. Here I go. Yeah! There we go. I no longer have doubts. Okay, let's try With using this. this. Okay, that was good. The time of the apocalypse is now. I shall go forth. <laughs> Just kidding. Useless, oh useless, useless. It's Uzume's turn. You're totally in the way. Not bad. All right, I'll go calmly. All right, can you just finish her off right Is here? This high speed sword dance? We, 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 yeah! we, we. Almost. This will not. She be has nine end. turns or like yeah. nine Consume APs, which means she go three hey, times, right? Perish. Yeah. It's Uzume's turn. Why do you keep attacking best <gasps> girl? Like why? I am defeated. Don't worry, I still really love Nepgear. Nepgear is like amazing, but. Although still, I'm surprised she's like level 27 when the other girls are like level 22. Like, why was she that strong? Impossible. How could I be defeated by these foolish children? Believe it. You're done. Huh? Hey, are you two CPUs perchance? Yes. Definitely. Sorry for the late intro, but I'm Uzume, and I'm the CPU of this nation. Thanks a lot for the help. We really needed it. Ooh, even in your normal form, you're pretty cool looking. Do you think I'm cool looking? Ha! I knew you'd get my vibe, Nepsy! Oh my you know, gosh. in your normal state, Nepgear, your looks are pretty similar to mine. If I ever had a younger sister, she might even look like you. Oh, what a pretty thought. I'd love to have a younger sister someday. Uh, um... <laughs> now, now, Nepsy. You're troubling Gearsy. Oops. Sorry, Gearsy. I didn't mean to trouble you. I 
just got excited. Oh, that's right. What do we do with this grotesque lady? Arbor, was it? Oh my gosh. What should we do? I didn't really think of what to do with her after she'd been defeated. We hadn't really expected the tables to turn in our favor like that. But now we have the perfect opportunity to beat some sense into her. <laughs> now then, what to do? I'm gonna punish you in my own super stylish way, so I hope you're prepared. Uh, I no longer have any will to fight you. Aren't you a CPU? As a CPU, you should treat prisoners according to the law. Law? Like I give a crap. I'm the CPU of this nation, and that means I am the law. Whatever I do oh. is the freaking law. Even if I beat you to a bloody dead pulp, as long as it's cool in my book, that's all that matters, right? Huh? Answer me! Violence is not the answer! Lucy <laughs> is really wow. getting into it, huh? She's acting like a nasty delinquent. This isn't unexpected. There has been a startling amount of rage welling inside of her. She's turning into quite the villain. Hey, hold your horses! Violence is no good! <sighs> what? You... you're going to save me? Step aside, Big Nepsy. I have no obligation to this monster, and she's not getting out alive. It's a bad move, Uzume. Anyway, I've decided to put this gross bug into my specimen book, so you can't. Uh-oh. What? I mean, come on. Check out those purple wings. She's like some kind of poisonous butterfly, so she's got to be a rare creature. Oh my gosh. So, okay, I'm buddy. I'm going to put her into my specimen book alive and make her part of my collection. <laughs> well... She is the most vile creature here. Exactly. Well, that's the deal, so it's absorption time. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> I'm getting sucked in! <laughs> Goodness, she's really shrinking and getting absorbed by that crazy book. Last but not least, I just tape her down and voila, it's finished. That's a pretty dope book if it can turn that hulking beast into a stupid little bug. What is the meaning of this? Who do you fools think I am? Release me this instant! I think she's saying something. Hey, if the book ends up so thick, won't you be unable to fully close it? Hey, don't you dare ignore me! Oh, no worries about that. There. Her. Oh, no, no, she's totally fine. I don't really get it, but if I close the book, I can preserve her as is. It's super convenient. This is so weird, but really freaking awesome. I know, that's what makes her probably the best girl here. I don't know, because I'm really deciphering on either Juan, Big Neptune, or Nepgear. At the very least, it I'm will speaking too loud, aren't I? Her around. And we can speak to her at our leisure afterwards. I'd still like to get a few punches in, though. Sure. But let's keep moving back to the base for now. Right. You gonna tag along, Big Nepsy? Is that okay with everyone? Of yes, course. especially me. Please, 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 please. I'd really please, like please. to thank you somehow. Yippee! <laughs> I've been kind of bummed out since I got here. It's been super lonely without anyone around. Plus... I've run out of food, so I've been on the brink of starvation for a little while. We'll make sure you get fed. The least we could do. Really? Thanks so much. Let us depart then. We may speak at length once we arrive at our destination. Oh my gosh, are you serious? You can raise the rank of the equipment item by using certain materials and credits. Oh boy, rank limit is dependent on the technology level. Each item also has a maximum amount of time. It can be strengthened. There's also certain items. There are certain items that has no strength limit. Cool. I don't think I'll remember that though. Okay, well, first things first. Um, I'm sorry, Nep Gear, but uh, Big Nep is uh, precious. So, level 23 though, that's kind of OP. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, let's go.
Alright, yeah, we're back to no English. Oh, dang. So not only is this their base, but this is also the base to some of the doggos or some of... Yeah, yeah. Actually, yeah, they are doggos. So, yeah. That's a... Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, no. No, wait. No, 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 no. Don't. No, don't. No, 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 no. Are we, are we, no, please, no, I, I already had, you know, enough of, you know, stuff, you know, stuff like that, I, I think, I think we're good. A black fae, which means that she has all the information that she needs to learn about us as human beings. Yes, that definitely would mean. Yep, absolutely, that's Nepgear's way of getting to her destination home. Oh, thank I'll rest for a bit. Wait, we can do more build runs? Oh, okay, no, we can't. Okay. Oh, would it be okay for me to call you Big Sis? Oh my gosh! Oh, this is cute. This is adorable. I approve of this. Okay, maybe you're digging in a little too much. <laughs> How long is this going to go on for? Oh, thank goodness that was long. I should take a bath. Just wait. Oh my gosh! Please no! Oh my! Holy crud! Why? That's not what I had. A little. First thing we get. I mean, it's all nap looking kind of hot, but I didn't need this again. I have to do some more censoring now. I was hoping not to see this again. The fifth part in. We're back to some more nudity. Like, why? Okay, so the summary of that part, they were just having some chit chat. Big Nev was, I think I remember one comment Big Nev said about, like, it's always great taking a bath together. Then, Uzume and Nepgear having to talk about the whole like thing about how you know she tried to save Uzume and how Uzume's trying to rebuild the nation back and how Nepgear's like, do you think you could you know visit us time and time here and here and whatever, all types of stuff. Big Nep is still really hot. Am I speaking way too loud? Cause I swear I feel like I am. Just looking at like the little microphone like audio right here, and it's like it's like popping off really fast. Cause I feel like I am. But at the same time, I really want to, you know? Wait, where's my water? I could've sworn I had water with me. That's cute. Oh, back to the net. Oh my gosh, we get Big Nev on the Nev station? Oh my goodness. So, the summary of that last part was that, um... The radio on Uzume's wrist is now, you know, improved. Thanks to, uh, you know, Nepgear. So, you know, yeah, y y you know. Now she's really impressed and she's really happy. Uzume, reporting in. Hi, Big Devsy. <laughs> Hi, Uzume. So, straight to the point, I didn't think I'd show up here so soon after my first appearance. This show, the show will get stuck in a rut if, you j if, if it's just me and Nepsy, so we gotta spice it up somehow. Darn straight. Still, you really saved our bacon by dropping in on us recently. Thanks again. You don't have to thank me. Thank the Skyfish. They're the real MVPs. <laughs> hey, the Skyfish yummy? Can you actually eat them? Great question, Uzume. I don't know, but they're called Skyfish, so they should be edible, right? I think they're kind of white fish. You really haven't eaten them, Uzume? No, I haven't, but they're... You're amazed. Unidentified mysterious animals, you know? I'm curious. Then I just have to prove they exist by catching and eating it. Bring it on. <laughs> For now, let's pull this back together and go to the episode preview. I'll leave it to you, Big Nepsy. The everyday life life we believed in without question crumbled away in a single instant. Our familiar landscape warped in flames, a daunting 
frame rises. Reunited in Gunfire, what did Nepgear and I feel? Next episode, Mobile Game Soldier Neptune. Its name is Nepgeardom? Revive the Land of War. Nepgeardom. <laughs> Alright, that was cute. That was cute. That was great. I mean, the important part is that- Oh, wow, no VR session this time. Oh, wait. I mean, then again, she's literally right there, so I guess that makes sense. So that's new. No VR session this time. Okay, so as you can tell from Nepgear's dialogue, they're just eating right now. They're having some good time eating. Uh, Big Nep made a joke about how she was going to feed uh, Arvor, if that's how you say her name, um, some weed, apparently. <laughs> Not the drug kind, but actually, wait. Never mind, maybe the drug kind, I don't know. Oof. <laughs> oh my gosh. Big Nep actually may be my favorite uh, character just in general. Uh, um, Nep Gear is probably my favorite CPU. Uh, borderline with, uh, you know, Blan. Blan. You know? I mean, admittedly, I am, a, I am almost 18. I'm still very limited to what I eat. So, you know. But the villain in the book are four likes eggplant. So wonderful. I'm gonna keep bit. going until, um. Oh, whoa. A torture session. Wait a minute. Hold up here. What's going on? Interrogation. Yeah, probably. Same difference. Okay, buddy. Wow. She's just complossed to it. She's like, well. Frick it, let's just go for it. I'll, I'll comply to your questions. Wow. So, after, so if Arvor defeats Uzume, she just destroys the world. Just point blank, you know, just destroy the world. She is a cliche villain. And I wonder if that's why we have a bunch of these fourth wall breaking or meta related heroes, especially Neptune and apparently Big Nep. But she is very hot indeed. That was literally it. Wow, I was expecting a lot more, but nope, that's not the case at all, surprisingly. Oh wait, isn't history, history like kind of just rebooting back in the other world? Like just thinking about it. Okay, Uzume, you need to chill. Uzume? 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 Calm down. Uzume, language. Well, apparently, language actually means, uh, get your coolness back together, not, you know, fix your freaking bad language. What the, you know. Oh, yep, yep. But actually, history's currently out like a light. Yep, knew it. Knew it. Huh, but guess what? You have Big Nep who can hop through dimensions. A snore. Wow. Okay. But even more surprising, you met a different dimension of me. Oh yeah, through Big Nip. Oh yeah. Oh no. Crosty technically, the book. Oh, that's why Big Neptune isn't, you know, already doing so. She just has to look for Crosty. I thought Crosty was in the book, but no, Crosty apparently got separated from the book. Okay, there's a lot more dialogue than I thought, but hey, as long as we get Big Nep, I'm okay with that. <laughs> no way, no way, no. Okay, uh, Neptune, you might need to chill. Like, I know, disgusting food is disgusting, but geez, holy crud. <laughs> Why does I Okay, buddy. This is so weird. There's literally the villain in the book, and she's just like, alright, I'll eat all the eggplants for you. And Big Neptune's like, oh my gosh, really? Yay! You won't have to eat the thing you dislike, and I can set. set. set to hate my hunger. Holy wow, I am bad at reading. Wow, there is more? How much more is there? 
And this is non-English too, so I have to like summarize some of these kinda. I mean, it's all about having lunch. Oh wait, hold up, wait, what's going on? We got a voice. This is a voice from heaven, right? What? You do not need to force yourself to eat what you hate. What you must do is dispose of what you dislike, but it is wrong to waste food. Wait, what? Oh. Wow. Wow. Wow, this is getting really weird. We're just feeding the villain who's in the book. Okay, I am honestly really hoping that for that reason alone that doesn't unleash R4 back up. Because if it does, that will be just, wow, I will be disappointed. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Now he's getting the voice. Right now, I'm speaking directly to your soul. You do not need to f Oh, whoops. Okay, this is getting suspicious. You must do is dispose of what you dislike, but it is wrong to waste food. No, wait, 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 wait. Didn't in- didn't R4 say in her mind, like, um, that if she were to be fed more, then she would gain more strength? Possibly? So... Isn't this an escape plan? And is this her voice? Or is this a giant's voice? Because you cannot tell me that a voice from heaven is saying, Hey, give food to the villain who, if she eats more food, she gains more power. You don't know that, but we know that. Because, you know, we're from heaven, right? This doesn't sound right. Okay, well, Nepgear thankfully hasn't fell for it. I think? Or is R4 really gonna escape? Because I feel like this shouldn't make sense for R4 to just, whoop, I'm yeeting out of the book. Isn't that exactly what I said? Isn't it that, you know, if she was fed more food, she had the power to escape? And isn't that what I said? So, you know, now she's, she's, she's escaped. See, I told you. Although I guess that does make sense. Why she was just like, yeah, I, I can just eat all your food. I guess that does make sense. But like when it started having that weird voice come through there, it started making more sense. Like, wait, but doesn't she gain power from eating? And you know, boom, she just oh, gained more power from eating. And just, wow, just wow. Mm. Okay, okay, big nap. Although, she's been eating a lot, so what does that mean? She's stronger, question mark? Oh no, she's just eating out. She's gonna eat out for now, and then she's gonna come back, she's gonna fight him again. Yeah, like, what's wrong with you guys? Come on, like, come... <sighs> you let her escape. Would you like to put some thought into that? See, maybe Nepgear is my favorite character, because even though I am just like Big Nep, where I am big, even though I'm actually not big, and, um, you know, I, there's a lot of food that I do dislike, admittedly, at least Nepgear is actually, you know, she's a little sister, but she's at least the maturest and nearly the hottest CPU and CPU candidate. Oh, great. It's one. That's, that's good. That's cool. It's one o'clock, guys. One in the morning, here we go. We're getting to that point in time. Oh, I was literally thinking she was just gonna yeet out of there by running, but no, she can apparently just teleport. That's great. Did Big Nip just seriously pick up a stick and just drop it and just say, all right, we're going there? Did she really just do that? Should I be disappointed or should I be laughing? All right, 
Um, where are we going exactly? Hold up. Let me see. Oh, there's also a new point right there. Oh. Ooh. Okay, so we're also going to a new area. So I'll... Pr oh, I don't know what I want to do. Because on one hand, I really want to keep going. Because I'm getting really invested into uh, the fact that you can now play Big Nep and all that type of stuff. So, it seems like the, we won't have any more VR sessions for now with Big Nep, but doesn't mean we still can't with some of the others. Hopefully we auto hopefully it auto saved all the conversations, all that stuff. And now let's have a VR session with I'm debating on if she's my favorite CPU or not. Blan. Here. <gasps> oh my gosh, she looks so cute! Is that what she sleeps in? Like it's Definitely a lot more different than her coated uniform. Oh my god. Um, oh my god. My name is Blan. I'm Blan? the goddess of Louis. Nice to meet you. So, Blan? Oh, 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 this is so adorable. Oh, sorry. I said that out of habit. It's okay. You're the player, so you already know about me, don't you? Yes! Oh my gosh, she's so adorable! Eastwald gave me a brief explanation earlier. Anyway... What? Why... Why are you staring at my face? <laughs> oh my gosh! It's just this a little... Embarrassing. This is so adorable! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> okay, I need to. By the way, <sighs> I thought I saw a bookshelf in here. Oh yeah, it could be over there. Oh, there it is. Oh. <laughs> what a relief. I'm glad you have one. I wasn't sure if that's what it was when I came through the gate. See, I, I really love books. I'm interested in all kinds of genres. However, lately. For reasons, I've been reading a light novel. Player, do you like reading books? Um, okay, if I had to read a book, sure. There are some books I like to read at least. Um, actually, hang on. If I can real quick, if you're actually just chill, just sitting right there. I actually do have an example of a book I like to read the most. It's actually a book that my father gave me, actually. Um, it's called The Secret of Success. I like reading some of the more motivational books because it kind of helps me, you know, learn through life. And, and, you know, this book is actually a really rare kind of book. It's not only is it, okay, admittedly is a bit religious, but it is, the way it's prescribed is that it gives a lot of examples about the people that are actually very positive. And I feel like, I feel like it's this book that's taught me, hey, if I have a positive mindset, if I have a good self-esteem, even if I probably may not, I could actually get through life just from reading this and just from having a positive self-esteem. So I feel like I kind of learned a lot, especially the Bible, you know, you can't go wrong with the Bible. So I feel like it depends on what book that I am fine with reading. So, um, yeah, so I guess in a way I can say, yes, I do. Really? You mean it? That's great! I'd like it if we could recommend some books to each other. It's a lot of She's fun so learning cute. about what hobbies other people are into. Her head. I love how words can unlock my imagination. I wish I can say it's the same, but reading not yet. So easily. It's a little easier for me to read because I like doing that. Some people don't have as much fun, though. They find it tiring. Light novels are easier for people like that. There isn't a lot of exposition to wade through, and since it's mostly dialogue, it's fairly easy to read. A lot of them are illustrated, too. They're the perfect novels for beginners. Wouldn't you agree? Light novels. Light novels is a style of Japanese novel primarily targeting high school and middle school students. The term light novel is a we see it go or Japanese term formed from words in the English language. Light novels are often called Rano beer or wait, ran, Rano 
Rano B, Rano B, or in the West, LN. The average length of a light novel is om- is what? Wait, 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 wait. Let me see this. Just hold on a sec, Bland. Hold on a sec. I know it's a serious question. But let me. Can I get an example? Let me see. Oh. <clears throat> oh. 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 Are light novels manga? Basically? This looks like manga. I don't know. I might need more examples. But it basically looks like manga. I don't know. If it's really just manga, then I mean, I can't imagine her being wrong, right? Right? I knew you would, player. I'm happy you can understand the light novel's appeal. I mean, maybe I have to double check it. rambling was worth it. <laughs> you know, my favorite author has an interesting story. What's crazy is that person never intended to become an author. Why she she was that, journaling all of her adventures. That's all she intended to do, but her writing skills improved with every entry. When her adventure diary was finally published, it made the bestseller list rather quickly. I feel like Other authors actually do that, like in the real novels, world. Usually evolve and write more literary works, bringing their secret worlds to life. The methods of expression among writers are as endless as the methods to interpret their writing. It's in the discussions and analysis that this theory is... Oh. The two of us just met. But here I am, talking your ears off about my little Oh hobby. no, it's fine, it's fine! I think we... Oh no, are you leaving? I I'm sorry. I I'm gonna go now. I just came here to say hello, but I got carried away. I'm honestly surprised. I'm not very good at conversation, and I hardly ever do this sort of thing. Oh my, it's okay. But I've been wanting to meet you. I just had a lot I wanted to talk to you about. Oh no, I'm gonna start rambling again. This Aww. was nice. I'm going to come back and visit. Is that okay? Yes! Well, please. thanks for listening today. See you. See you later. Oh my gosh, look how slow she walks to it. She doesn't like hop through it as, you know, escally as, you know, the rest of them. Also, um, one thing I wanted to point out really fast, it's 109 right now, and there was a clock at like the little top corner, and I could have sworn it was basically in real life time, because the little hour hand was pointing towards what looked like the one hour, so I'm really curious if that time actually is, uh, you know, exact with my time. Also, what I find really interesting is that I think I remember why me, or I think I remember why Blonde, might be my favorite CPU, and it's because I have a little bit of a common with her. Maybe I don't have the same interest in reading books, even though there are some books I like to read, but um, how she kind of just, you know, she likes to ramble on sometimes. I like to ramble on a lot, and I mean a lot, especially when it comes to commentary when I can't fill in a certain hole. Rambling for me is like a special suit for me, and I feel like I like to do it a lot. And also, the fact that she looks a little shy, so she might be an introvert, you know, and she likes to ramble on a lot, and she's not good at conversations. Personally, that's exactly me. I'm not in the great at conversations. I'm an introvert. I'm kind of shy sometimes. I mean, maybe I'm mostly shy around girls, obviously, since I don't know how you talk to a girl without flirting with them, since that's almost impossible nowadays, but... We have a lot in common. Maybe that's why I feel like she's my favorite CPU. And because of that VR session alone, she actually might be again. And Nepgear might be second favorite. Big Nep might be either second or third. Because Big Nep is, whoa, Big Nep. The thighs, the aesthetic attitude. She's so energetic. She's so cute. And she's got a gun. How could she not want a gun? <laughs> Okay, I'm sorry, but uh, one more before I end off this video. I was reading a book. <laughs> oh, look at that. Where am I? I'm actually standing. Oh my 
gosh, look at she slowly walks to me. Oh, That's so precious. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what are you up to? <laughs> oh, I see. I'm sorry. I'm probably waking up my sister at this uh, point. Hmm. <gasps> yes. I'm curious. Uh, um, I'm sorry for asking, but do you mind if I take a look at your books? Uh, yeah, sure. Sure thing. Oh, oh my, oh my, whoa! We get to go. Is she taller than me? Oh. Holy cow, she is so up close. I'm gonna do this in VR just to see how close this is. Holy cow. I'm surprised for being a little bit of an introvert. She is okay with this type of spacing. Wow. Yeah, that, okay, yeah, that definitely looks like a manga. Why is she tall, though? Oh, my gosh. Why is she so tall? Why am I, like, the same height as I was on the couch? Thanks a lot. You've got books I've never seen before. They're so interesting. Oh, my gosh. But it might be a good idea to add some more to your collection. I am actually mm. going to die for her. Like, legit. Mm. Here's an idea. I can start bringing you some books for my oh, she's when I come tall, to visit like, you. If I you just can look never have straight. too many. I'm looking at her neck. I would like to put some of my favorites on your shelf. Isn't she also small too from what I researched? It would make me really happy if you ever got the chance to read through a few of them. I'd like for you to I'll do it because you said so. As well. <laughs> I'll do it because you said my so. Oh, books she... are here. I feel like that would help me feel less nervous in your room. By I guess that way, makes sense. Would it be okay if I read one of your books for a little bit? Yeah, sure thing. Right? Right? Yeah, she's gonna do so. It's the... Yeah, that. I've been curious about this one for a while now. Oh my gosh. Dear God, help me. Mm. I, this is why we don't have waifus real life because there's people like blonde look at her oh. <gasps> she's i'm sorry she's so adorable is that a once i open up a book it's easy for me to get lost in it but i think that's how i feel about playing this game i think i feel reassured i'm just wondering is it oh, like a thing it's where nothing don't worry She's really up close, though. I, is that like a share crystal? So it's is this like, like a novel I was just reading? Even though I only read a little bit, the character felt so alive. Her feelings were so beautifully wrought. <sighs> what lovely writing! If she can feel that in like thirty seconds of reading, she has to be like a uh, college level reader right there. And I'm hardly, and I mean hardly a reader. Even though I like to read this book, for example. Does this have a sequel? Holy Could you moly. possibly get it for me? Now that or you ask, look. maybe I can go and buy them all and keep them here. Oh, could it be? I knew it. This book doesn't exist in game industry. Although, but it kind of does, because it has a share crystal on the back, so it's like, are you sure? Oh my gosh, look how lovely she is. If there's she a looks. sequel that exists, oh or if it ever comes out, I'd really appreciate it if you could buy it for I'm going to do like the thumbnail, like... And I'll be sure to keep a lookout <laughs> for any books that I think you'd like to read. At this rate, we'll end up talking about books forever. So it's probably a good time for me to leave. No! Why? <laughs> Thanks so much for letting me read this. You're welcome. All right, then. I'll see you soon.
I'm sorry, but I think she just might be my favorite CPU. Just, just that, just that way. Just, I don't know how to express the way that. First of all, how lovely she speaks. Number one, like, wow. And number two, she's really cute. Like, you obviously can't deny that. But like, I'm, I'm shocked, just how adorable she looks, how, and how tall she is. Like, can we talk about that for a sec? She was literally like, I don't know if it's like camera view wise, and it's just you know lazy stuff where they have like the same y axis or whatever. But whoa, she is tall. Like, all, well, then again, all of them look kind of tall. Even Neptune, she looked kind of tall. But, like, whoa! I was at neck level with her. And I'm, like, what? Like, five foot three and a half, maybe? I don't know. And I'm, like, neck level to her. So, whoa. She is tall. But then again, I'm completely fine if she is tall. Because I'm not going to lie. And I don't want to be that guy. And I don't want to sound really weird. But if you're wondering what kind of girls I'm interested in, I am interested in pretty tall girls. And if she actually is tall, she is the perfect one. Then there's also Monica. Oh boy. We have two competitors. Okay. I'm going to just stop right there before I get too enthusiastic with this because it's, I love blonde. I love blonde. She's, she's adorable. <laughs> oh my gosh. I've never seen such adorableness right in front of me. I'm going to just re-experience that in VR just so I can get the feel of it. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, give it a like and share the video and subscribe to the channel. And I really hope we get to play as blonde in this game soon. I'm going to make her leader on site. Hope you guys have enjoyed this. Take care. God, God, God bless you guys. And if you're actually up to this point of the video, comment section, who do you think is better? Blonde, Big Nep, or Nep Gear? Or I'll put a poll on that on my community tab when this video releases. So stay tuned or whatever.